Hi guys, it's me, Debbie Bubbles. Welcome back to my channel and into the walls of my home. This evening, y'all, I am participating in Dad's Picnic Tablescape. This is an open collaboration which is hosted by The Grace Life, DIY Home Decor, Deborah Cabasa Home Living, At Home with Lisa Lisa, and Sandy's Home and Garden. In tonight's video, I am going to style out an indoor Father's Day picnic setting complete with food and drink and dessert. <laughs> so y'all keep watching. And if you have a keen eye, leave me a comment in the comment section and let me know what one thing ended up changing by the end of the video. So here I'm going over some of the items that may or may not end up in the final tablescape setting, but there is a point where I have things pretty much complete and then I changed my mind about one particular item so it disappeared and something else came in entirely different so if you have a good eye you might spy it now you may or may not know that my father is no longer here with me here on earth he is passed on transition on homeward and I am stalling this tablescape in honor of him on this table, there will be several of his favorite things. Now, he was a lemonade guy. He loved fresh, freshly squeezed lemonade. So there's gonna be lemonade. And he also enjoyed his watermelon. My father was a Southern man. He was a Louisianan and he loved his lemon meringue pie. And I had the honor of making some for him while he was still present and so today we're gonna enjoy one a slice of one in honor of him along with all the other items that I'm gonna set on the table now y'all here's that wonderful lemonade and there's my happy Father's Day 2024 sign excuse the handwriting and I didn't have any chalk I didn't think about chalk at the time so I used a um, lip liner so <laughs> We'll be correcting that before we use this for another video, but that is an actual chalkboard that is fashioned in the shape of a grill, and I thought that was fitting for this setting. Now you'll notice several Dollar Tree items on this table, that towel, the candles, that item there, the um, Father's Day grill plaque, that is actually from Family Dollar, but it is just as cute as it can be. It was one dollar as well. Now. There's a watermelon coming in with some fresh lemonade. And what do we behold here? Is it chicken? No, he wasn't, he ate chicken, but he was a seafood man. He loved his baby back ribs, which are what I'm gonna eat in honor of him tomorrow for dinner. But for today, we're gonna have fried catfish. We have deep fried whole catfish there on this tablescape, fresh squeezed lemonade, a lemon meringue pie with a lemon twist, fresh watermelon, some beautiful flowers in blue, just to bring in a little masculine touch there, collard greens, and macaroni and cheese, corkscrew macaroni and cheese. Now, we found in the thrift store the other day, and you'll see these, some of these items in hauls coming up, but those beautiful napkins there in the gingham, the red and white gingham print, those were thrifted in a thrift store, brand new y'all, brand spanking new, and they were $1.91 and half off for a set of four. <laughs> so, have y'all yet spied the one item that changed up in this setting? It's right before your eyes and mine. As I said in yesterday's video for an entryway stalling, I'm gonna say again today, y'all, if you have a father, a husband, a friend, a son, if there is some male in your life who is a father figure, whether it's a, he's a father biologically or just by blessing, be a blessing and an encouragement to him and show him some love, honor him, tomorrow on Father's Day and let him know how he and the wisdom that he bestows into others. Let him know how much it matters, how much it means 
let him know that he is an encourager and encourage him to continue with the work that is at hand. Y'all, I'm going to leave you alone. And in closing, there are a few more still shots, but I just want to remind y'all that I love you and I pray for you that you have a blessed and beautiful evening. God bless you. Happy Father's Day to all the daddies out there, all the fathers. And I'll see you the next time I turn on this camera. Bye-bye for now.